oh my god I'm totally gonna cry <laughs> don't cry because then you'll make me cry <laughs> My name is Elizabeth. My name is Iowana, and uh, my son's name is Zahi. He's two and a half. Normita has been our nanny and worked with us for the last 23 years. My nanny's name is Dida. She was a bit shy, and I spoke a little bit of Spanish, and so I decided that I really wanted to learn more Spanish, so I just told her, I'm just going to speak Spanish, and if I don't speak it well, help me out. I just remember feeling almost immediately, this is it, like she's just awesome. But over the years, we just became so close and she knows everything about my family and she shared so much about her family that I know everything about her family. So our relationship has really blossomed. It just felt immediately comfortable and great and um, she came into sort of this chaotic situation for us and provided immediate ease, an immediate sense of like, I got this. Sometimes we cry together and laugh. We laugh a lot together. So the last time we saw Zaida was probably four to five months ago. Um, it feels like an eternity. I know she knows how I feel about her because we've been together for 23 years, but I never really openly shared my appreciation of her. We just wanted to let her know how grateful we are. This is the letter. I made an attempt at writing this letter, but to be honest, it doesn't even come close to how we feel. Oh my God, I'm totally gonna cry. <laughs> Don't cry, because then you'll make me cry. <laughs> I'm totally crying, this is amazing. Okay, so Normita, I wrote this letter about you because I'm so thankful that you're in my life and I wanted you to know that and I wanted to just share some things that I have in my heart for you. Dear Zaida, we miss you. Dearest Normita, even though I see you every week and we spend time together talking about what's going on in our lives, I have never really shared how much I appreciate you. We wanted to write you this letter and let you know how thankful we are for all you've done for our family. Can you believe you started helping me with my two girls 23 years ago? Especially during these challenging times. <laughs> Due to the pandemic, we are especially aware of all the ways in which you help us balance life in New York City as working parents with a baby, Marina was just one year old, Bianca was four, and I was so happy that you could be with them while I went to work. I knew they were safe in your care. It's always happy to see you. And lights up at every new adventure you have together. Whether it's learning a new song, drawing a new anything, or working on a new skill. When I reflect on when the girls were little, I remember it as an overwhelming stage in my life. Balancing work, motherhood, and my marriage felt impossible at times. You showed up at our door on your day off with the only other spare key that was in your hands when I got locked out with Zahi and Dan was out of state. You did not complain and did just the opposite. You smiled, you laughed, and you stayed a bit longer just to see if it would work. But one day when you were at my house, I broke down. I was crying and sobbing and feeling completely overwhelmed with what seemed like the weight of the entire world on my shoulders. You were there. You showed up and you brought all the sunshine. You shared that you struggled with a lot of the same things that I did and that made me feel so much better. Since that day, we have always shared our feelings and challenges that we were going through. I shared with you more than anyone else in my life. You've become part of our family, often talking with grandparents and calling them when we're not around to fill them in on Zahi or let them have a chance to be with him over video chats. 
Fast forward 18 years to when my girls went off to college and my nest was empty and my heart was broken. You were there while I cried for hours. Again, you somehow made me feel better telling me that we raised two successful young women and that they were off to start their own lives. Zahi is filled with magic, music, laughter, and learning when you are around. I'm so grateful that you are part of my life, Normita. You are a blessing to this family. This and just so many more reasons are why we are so, so grateful. I trust you with my children, my home, and my heart. Thank you so much for all you do. <laughs> Thank you, Normita, for everything. <laughs> <laughs> I wasn't prepared. <laughs> Me ayudaste mucho. Gracias a ti por la confianza también. I missed you guys so much. I'm just like, just seeing you on the computer just brightens up my day. Cuando llegué a este país tenía mucho miedo. Mm -hmm. Recuerdo un trabajo que tuve primero. Fui maltratada. Mm. You know, he's my buddy. He's, he's one of my best friends. Cuando te, lo, te conocí a ti, fue todo lo contrario. Pensé, oh, wow, no todos los americanos son, son lo mismo. Ella es diferente. He, he misses you and he talks about you daily. Para mí, tus niñas, yo no la veía como que yo era su baby. Sí, yo la veía como que eran mis hijas. Y quería todo mi tiempo para ella. Y quería tiempo para limpiar. Quería todo. Quería agradarte a ti. Y tener contentas a las niñas. Oh my gosh. This is awesome. 